And let me get a couple more um, off your card on February 4th. Um, your son, Lamar Roach, um, I think last time I spoke with him, he was trying to get the fight with um, uh, Robert Gutierrez. Robert obviously fought uh, Hector Garcia. Hector beat him. Hector fought Tank. Tank beat Hector. Uh, who's next for uh, your son, Lamar Roach? Who do you think he could possibly I think be in with? We'll be the number one for Hector. Hector went up in weight. So Hector is going back down. So it's right. either we fight Hector or they were saying we was going to fight the number two guy. But it looked like we're going to have to fight Hector. So um, that should be something should be coming soon. But it's going to be for the world title. So get ready. DMV, mm. DC, we're bringing that baby home. Mm. So, so possibly, well, nine times out of ten in 2023, we will see Lamont Rose Jr. take on Hector Garcia for the world title. Absolutely. You guys see this is an exclusive from his father, Lamont Rose Sr., Lamont Rose Jr., Hector Garcia, another terrific fight. Um, it's going to be a silly question. Can we get the fight on the East Coast? Hey, look, that's what we got to get that strap, baby. We get that strap, we can call the car. So once we get it, we're coming back to the East Coast for sure. We're going to do yeah. big for the city. Yeah. yeah. What, do you, what do you think of uh, Hector uh, Garcia? I like him, veteran guy. Um, little, little out is going up in weight, you know, it's tough tags, fighting tank. Um, I, exactly what I thought was going to happen. Actually, exact punch punch that I thought was going to take him out happened. But he's he's a guy that went to the Olympics, a lot of amateur experience, veteran, you know, got confidence. So he's a champion for a reason. So um, it's going to be a great fight. Mm. Lamont obviously fought um, um, uh, Jamel Heron. What do you think, uh, Hector Garcia? How do you compare him to Jamel? Obviously, he's a different person. But... A different person but similar styles but it's, it's a difference um you know so but it ain't nothing we ain't seen before like we learned a lot from that fight um came this close to being a world title that fight very mm -hmm. close um mm -hmm. but it wasn't our time but now our time we more than ready for hector and for whoever else got them traps and i'm sure you know lamont having a you know a son now you've been a granddad i'm sure that's you know added motivation for you know lamont to go in there you know push the extra you know uh, uh, five thousand percent. So yeah, for sure. He got enough mouth to feed. It's, 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 it's thought process different, and, and he's reaching his prime. Mm -hmm. You know, he's, he's he's keep getting better and better, and you're gonna see some more new wrinkles to his offense and um his training. You know, so we added some more things to it. We constantly working on stuff. Um, it's our time. Mm -hmm. How do you how how would you think that you would get um uh, Lamont ready? Not get him ready, but I mean, obviously, you can't tell me everything, but, you know, who who do you think could get uh, Lamont ready for Hector Garcia? Or maybe one one possible person you think could get him ready? If you could disclose um, it. It's top secret information, but we must believe okay. it have been the yeah, okay. training camps, yeah. and we know how to prepare, okay. so he's going to yeah. be more than ready. <laughs> we, we already been ready for Hector Garcia. We was getting ready back then, right. so we still ready, so. Yeah. He's going to be in for a rude awakening, I'll tell you that. Mm -hmm.